Scott Turnbell had asthma, but his family says he was active and healthy and strong, and his asthma in no way contributed to his death. His wife wants to send a message to everyone she can reach. If you have the flu and you're not getting better, get help. He's a very special man, and we're going to miss him a lot. Married in 2007, Scott and Amy had Will, now six years old, and Alec, who's two. This past Christmas, we lost electricity, and um, we were out all night without power, and he was up all night building their toys for the next day by candlelight. He built a train table for them, and um, he did everything he could to make their lives the best that they could have. Scott worked as a computer programmer for FedEx. His dream was to make a, a video game, and he, he was on his way. And, uh, I believe Nintendo wanted to invite him to their convention this year to share his game, and it's, it's sad that he's not going to be able to complete his dream. When Scott got the flu a few weeks ago, Amy took him to the doctor. They helped him. They gave him the medicine to help him with it and everything, and uh, I just think that the time of the year didn't help with everything. Amy took Scott to the hospital when he just kept getting worse. He was sick for 12 days when I took him to the ER, and they found a bacterial infection. And um, he just, after that, it went downhill, and they tried everything they could. They were wonderful doctors. The bacterial infection attacked Scott's heart. He died last Friday. Amy doesn't want anyone else to feel the heartbreak she's feeling now. If you're sick for more than a week or like 10 days come up and you're still not feeling well, um, go seek help from your doctor or go to the ER, what do they need? Because it escalates quickly and you know, the unfortunate death can happen. It's, it's heartbreaking and I feel like I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up from it. And it's, it hurts to see my boys hurt. An incredible loss there. Now, her advice is if you think you have the flu, call your doctor. And if your doctor wants you to come in and be seen, do that. If your doctor tells you to go to the hospital, go to the hospital. The harsh reality is that sometimes the flu is going to take lives of healthy and strong young people. Heartbreaking. Yeah.